Hey everyone, what is going on? This is Only Me Feet here, bringing you all a Robocop vs. Terminator gameplay for the Sega Genesis. Yeah, that's right everyone, this is Robocop vs. Terminator. Just wanted to say that again because that is pretty damn epic. So as you can see here, I'm just Robocop, I'm just tearing it up. Look, look at this. These guys don't even stand a chance. Why would you even try to attack something coming at you that just eats bullets, disintegrates you into a pile of blood, and is being controlled by only use me feet? Who would want to go up with that against that? Look at Call of Duty. It, count how many people backed out of a Call of Duty game I was in. That's fear, ladies and gentlemen. You don't even see the five hours of lobbies I had to sit in because people just always back out when they see my name. It's quite annoying. But anyways, back to the gameplay here. Robocop, he's a pretty cool guy. I mean, you can just see him tearing, him, tearing it up here. Now, one thing I do kind of wish this game offered was the ability to play as the bad guys or the Terminator. Is that would just be really cool because the Terminators, I like the Terminator better. I'm going to be quite honest with you all. Arnold Schwarzenegger, you can't get much better than that. Well, I don't know. People probably don't like him now because of political BS. But you know what? Whatever. I love him. Arnold is a cool, cool guy. But this game is really cool. I think it shows off what the Genesis can do. And the amount of blood is awesome. I think this game has more blood than the early Mortal Kombat's. And that's really saying something. Um, but this is just one of the, I think, hidden gems of the 16-bit era. And I say that because this was also on the Super Nintendo. But that port did not have blood in it at all. So therefore... This port's a lot better. Yep. Yep, only blood. I mean, that. I mean, look at this game and imagine it without blood. That's like... That would be like if Call of Duty didn't have guns. And you would just knife each other. Blade would be in heaven. But, um... Yeah, that's pretty much what the, that would be like. You need blood in this game for it to be fun. And it, this game really is fun. Yeah, it has some of the classic uh, platformer cliches, like rescue all the people, which you don't technically have to do, as you see in this video, and, uh, you know, defuse the bombs, etc. But uh, it's really a lot of fun, and doesn't really feel boring, because the game is just so quickly paced. And uh, I think the frame rate might might have dipped a couple times in this video, but it runs perfectly if I didn't capture it. Um, anyways, so uh, this game, it's really cool, and I really do enjoy it. So the reason why I'm doing this series and the reason why there's this random RoboCop video on my YouTube channel is because I want to turn this into a new series. Uh, classic commentaries. I, I don't know, I'll come up with a way better name. But, basically, I just want to show you all games that are not Call of Duty or Battlefield or Tome Front or Time Splitters, by the way, the best one. Uh, just other than FPSs, you know. I just want to show you guys what was good back in the 90s. Um, and if you guys ever want to suggest me a game from back in the 90s, please just leave a comment below, tweet at me, whatever. By the way, follow me on Twitter or else I will run over your wheels. But um, anyways, just tweet at me a game you want me to showcase on here. I got the next two games lined up after this one, so you guys won't get any input for a couple videos. But I do want to turn this into a common thing. And uh, overall, I'll just show you guys that... Hey, you know what? Games back then were a lot of fun, too. And maybe we should look back and get some of those old gaming consoles to play gems like these. So anyway, that's the end of this video, everyone. You can see my tally being tallied now. And uh, you can see I just owned the Terminator there by sheer power. But anyways, this is only me feet saying, look, ma, no hands. Later.